So this G Skyer telescope was sent to our family a few weeks ago so we could make this video, try it out, see what a telescope is like. My son has been begging us to get a telescope. So we've had a lot of fun trying this out. Let me tell you what I do and don't like about it. So for one, it's cool. It does have this adapter. You can see you can use a smartphone to get footage if you want. That being said, it's pretty difficult to get a good shot with the smartphone. Uh, I just don't know if it's because of the adapter or just the nature of trying to use a phone with a telescope, but not super easy. But it does come with a bunch of different eye attachments. So you've got different zoom levels. Then of course you can kind of focus in and out. And that's really fun that you can view things from different distances. What my family has had the most fun with is probably at night, looking at the moon, seeing the craters on the moon. Just really fascinating with this. So it does come with everything you see here. It comes with different eye attachments attachments, its own tripod, and a bunch of other stuff. And this is my first experience with a telescope, so I don't really know what to expect. The things that I have found difficult, so to adjust this, you've got this bar down here, so you can kind of move it up and down, but then you have another little tightening thing that you have to loosen so you can move left and right. So there's two separate things that you have to adjust just to point it where you want. That seems a little over convoluted to me. I feel like you should be able to have just a single bar to be able to loosen it and tighten it where you want it to go. But you do have to do the left and right adjustment. And maybe that's just to make it that much more secure. But by far the easiest struggle that I've had with this is it's really hard to focus because anytime you touch it, when you're zoomed in all the way, it's going to move it and bump it. And it's just difficult to focus. I imagine for a more professional grade telescope, there's probably some device where you don't have to touch it manually, but you can focus some of the way. I'm not sure. Again, I've never used a telescope before, but for someone using it for the first time, that's by far the biggest difficulty I've had is just trying to get it in focus and staying in focus and pointing where you want it to go. But our family's had a ton of fun with this. This is not expensive. So this is a nice, easy way to introduce kids or someone to a telescope. So this is great for my son. He now knows what a telescope is like. He knows that it is a bit of work to get everything to work. And you can't just look at it and magically see in perfect detail. But it does require some work. But when you do get it in focus and you got it pointed at what you want, it's just really, really cool. So much fun. Definitely worth checking out. Thanks for watching.